A voluntary evacuation order has been issued for parts of Jefferson Parish. That order went into effect 6 a.m. on Saturday morning. Grand Isle, though, is under a mandatory evacuation order. Mm -hmm. totally Mayor David Carmadell is joining us by phone this morning with more. Mayor Carmadell, thank you so much for joining us. Good morning. Good morning. Tell yes, us more. Well, yeah, tell us more about what you guys are doing to prepare. Well, the water's pouring in from the backside of the island. Um, discussion in it on the backside, and also we got some serious, serious erosion problem uh, where the core didn't continue putting the rocks on the Gulf side. But uh, it's poured in. But we have some during the night. We had a bunch, of, a few gusses that came through, and again, it's, uh, like he said, they got another band coming through. But uh, it's just pouring in, and we know high tides at 11 o'clock, and uh, you know we just uh, monitor the situation and got our guys out, got our pumps out last night, all the extra pumps, but. We can't do nothing until, uh, you know, until this water subsides a little bit. And in the meantime, uh, it's just circling behind the back of the island, just pouring in. Sure. And then coming out of the same thing, uh, um, just coming in from the backside of the, the island. Did you find that residents are heeding the evacuation orders? We know there's a lot going on right now, including this pandemic. Yes, you know, most of the residents stayed. But there are a lot of the camp owners and tourists that we had this weekend. We got them out and, uh, you know, it just, uh, it's to a point where it's just a tropical storm and it looks like matters are getting worse. You know, the water's getting coming in from uh, different angles and it's just, uh, it's, it's just, it's something where, you know, it's, uh, it's, we're worried more about LA1 getting the people out from the levee system in Golden Meadow to Leeville and then from Port Fouchon to the Grand Isle. Sure. So that makes a big difference and we're making sure that the people got out. But again, uh, it's coming in like crazy the tide. We're going to monitor it and, and just make sure that our crews on standby, working with the police department, with the council, uh, we're just going to make sure that, uh, you know, we're going to uh, get out there and start pumping what we got to pump out, you know. Yes. All right. Mayor David Carmadell, thank you so much for joining us. Um, we will check back in with you later on and see how things are going. Thank you all so much.